Hi, this is Courtney Millison. I want to take a few minutes to talk to you about scoring the personal reporter communication apprehension, or as it's listed in your weekly guide, the PRCA. Um, this is a tool that was created to help you um, gauge your anxiety in four different types of public speaking areas. The first is group discussion. The second is meetings. The third is interpersonal conversations. And finally, public speaking. So the way that you use this worksheet is you are going to be able to download this and in Excel. If your computer doesn't have Excel, you can take this file and upload it into the Google Drive and open it in Sheets. And it will still have all of the formatting that's um, seen here on the worksheet. But if you do have Excel, what you're going to be able to do is go to question two, the one that you've answered. And in this area, you will find a pull down box and you're going to be able to select one through five. You can um, do that for each of the boxes here. And while you're doing it, it's automatically tabulating your results for your speaking anxiety level when it comes to group discussions. You're going to do that for each of the four different areas. And at the bottom, you're going to have a total score. The, um, the score should range anywhere from 24 to 120. And if it falls beneath 24 or above 120, there's a miscalculation somewhere in the spreadsheet. However, most of them will be between 83 and 120, which is a high level of um, communication apprehension. 55 through 83 is a moderate level. And 24 through 55 indicate a low level of apprehension. So just to show you that again, how you go through an answer, I'm going to look at question eight and see whether I scored a one, two, three, or five. Based on that, I'm going to come in and I'm going to put that information in this box. If I were to try to type a seven in here, I'm going to get an error. So that will just help keep you on task and make sure that you're entering the scores appropriately. Okay, once you're done with this, you can use this information to complete the discussion board that's held within your class. If you have any further questions, please don't hesitate to contact your instructor. Thanks so much.